begin by sharing something that recently crossed my desk. Something that speaks to the question of why we do what we do. The exhibit showed me what awaits us in the future. Seeing robots like that made me think, can I make it bigger and better? Can I make it smarter and faster? I say to myself, I can do that. It's possible. That letter was written by a sixth grader at a public school in Chicago after seeing Robot Revolution. Sparking the imagination that leads to a passion for all things science and technology is the driving force behind everything we do at the Franklin Institute. Robot Revolution is a unique collection of 40 cutting-edge robots curated from some of the most innovative global robotic companies and universities designed to show the depth and breadth of robotics. You've all heard me say this before. Philadelphia is a true city of science, in innovation, and in technology. Robotics is an ever-growing field. People want to learn more. They want to engage more. Self-driving cars are among us and all over the news just even this week. And the same with drones. To that end, the demand for qualified robotics engineers is expected to grow by as much as 13% by 2018. Robot Revolution provides a greater interest in understanding of robotics and the important role robots play in aiding and improving our everyday lives. And that is so important to inspiring those future mechanical and robotic engineers, programmers, developers, and technicians. In fact, within the exhibition is an actual open tech lab staffed with robot specialists who are on standby at all times for charges, adjustments, tweaks, and repairs to all the robots in plain sight. Robots that assist in medical surgeries, police and military operations, scientific research, and manufacturing jobs. Others provide comfort to medical patients and strength and endurance to those who are paralyzed. But true to form here at the Franklin Institute, I promise you, you will have fun with these robots. Baxter, right here next to me, is an expert Tic Tac Go player. If you're more of a blackjack player, there's a robot for that over there. Cube Solver, to my far right, will process color and solve a Rubik's Cube on demand. And in the gallery behind you, teams of robots face off in hourly soccer matches, and some robots will even dance for you. It wouldn't be the Franklin Institute if you weren't able to interact hands-on with robots. So build and play with cubelets as well. What a great opportunity for students to become inspired to enter the exciting field of robotics. <laughs> Do you see it? <laughs> <laughs> Sit down. Yep. Stand up. <laughs> <laughs>